the energy market, the energy world has to be starting to be getting a little concerned or maybe a lot concerned. Hello, my friends. Welcome to The Electric Viking and thank you for subscribing and supporting the channel. It means a lot to me. It's the reason why we've increased our number of videos we're making per day from two to three, 14 to it per week to 21 per week. Pretty sure I got that math right. Yep, I did. Now, Tesla is disrupting many of the world's markets. Most importantly, the two biggest, the automotive industry and the energy industry. Now, the energy industry disruption is not really getting the credit it deserves. Right now, Tesla is building a team of energy traders. And now you're probably thinking, yeah, so what, Viking? That means nothing to me. Well, it should mean something to you because Tesla is about to disrupt the world's largest market, the energy market. And that matters because it won't be just Tesla doing the disruption. It will be a number of companies. Tesla is just one of them. So lots of money is moving from here, as I've said many times before, to here. You might as well take some of it, right? Makes sense, yeah? Now, Electric has reported on this, and I quote, some people trade stocks, but Tesla wants to trade energy capacity. The company is building a new team of traders to do just that with its auto bidder platform. Now, before I go on, I had a discussion today with a watcher of the channel who has just bought two 10 kilowatt hour battery packs from BYD. I'm not going to disclose any more information about that, but the price was pretty incredible. Maybe BYD will get on this. But anyway, the point is, you individually as a person will be able to disrupt the energy industry by owning batteries and solar and then using Tesla's auto bidder platform so that you and Tesla make money together. Now, whether you have batteries in your car or battery storage at your home, doesn't matter. You'll be able to disrupt the energy industry in many, depends on the country you're in, but eventually this will probably affect every country in the world, I think. Now, auto bidder is a real-time trading and control platform for energy assets like Tesla's power packs, power walls, and mega packs optimized through machine learning to better use and more directly monetize the assets. So it's basically a version of AI that can make you money while you sleep or when you're not using your batteries, when you're not using your energy power at home, Tesla can make you money and them money at the same time by reselling your energy to the grid. I think it's genius. I love it because what's going to happen is renewable energy won't have to just be built out by governments or by organizations, but you as a person can play a part in this renewable energy build out and the transformation of the world from going from coal, essentially, and gas and nuclear. Yep, I used to think nuclear was good, but it no longer makes any financial sense. Look it up. To one of renewable energy that makes complete sense for you on a financial level, complete sense for the world on an ecological level. It's genius, right? Now, AutoBidder was first launched last year, and earlier this year, we learned that it already has over 1.2 gigawatt hours of energy storage under management. It's happening quickly. As Tesla deploys more energy assets, the product is becoming increasingly important for the company. Important enough that Tesla is now building a team of traders who are going to be monetizing those assets through that platform. Yesterday, Julian Lamy, Tesla's head of energy, energy trading and market operations announced on LinkedIn. I'm excited to announce that I'm building a new team at Tesla focused on energy trading and market operations. The team will drive performance of Tesla's global fleet of battery plus renewable projects, build expertise in wholesale energy markets, and support development of AutoBidder, Tesla's automated energy trading platform. He linked a job listing for senior energy trading analyst, Energy Markets. Now, I'll get to the job description in a minute, but just think about this. When everyone has an electric car, or everyone now who now has a petrol or diesel natural gas, whatever powered car you have, poo powered, whatever it is, when everyone has an electric car who previously owned an ICE vehicle, one of the many, many, many benefits, and there are many benefits, is that they'll be able to make money from that car by using that car to sell energy back to the grid or using that car to run their own energy at their own house. Now, the job description. Sounds like a stock trader for energy assets. I love it. We are looking for a senior energy trading analyst to drive continual performance improvements of the largest fleet of battery storage projects in the world. This includes Tesla's utility scale battery fleet, i.e. 
transmission level and virtual power plants, i.e. aggregation of residential batteries at the distribution level. Using Tesla's in-house automated trading platform, AutoBidder, you will be responsible for bidding batteries into multiple wholesale energy markets, ensuring the assets meet contractual obligations and complying with market rules. This includes developing and executing trading strategies, monitoring automated trading systems, balancing risk and expected returns from different trading strategies, making real-time trade decisions during key market opportunities, analyzing asset performance and market conditions. This is a very long sentence. Developing tools to support analytics, developing and prototyping new algorithm ideas and strategies as part of the team's R&D progress, communicating complex situations to broad audiences and presenting to internal and external stakeholders. And that is the longest sentence I've ever read out on this YouTube channel after making 350 videos. Full stop. Now, Tesla is apparently looking to build a whole team of those traders in order to manage their increasing energy assets, which are growing fast through large new battery projects using Megapack, but also new power plants more recently announced. Now, Tesla's battery Megapacks are actually sold out till the end of 2022, right? Sold out till the end of 22. Remember, Tesla has plans for 4680 battery cell production in Austin, in California, in Germany, and in China, plus they have CATL building a 70 gigawatt hour battery factory for them in Shanghai that will be using just solely for Tesla's batteries. Tesla gets batteries from LG Chem, from Panasonic, from CATL right now as well. And they're looking into battery energy contracts with other companies as well. They're basically saying, give us as much as you can, right? Plus they're deploying all their mega packs they have access to. They've sold out for the next nearly a year and a half. There's huge numbers of battery projects going up and this number is going to just dramatically increase. In addition, imagine the, all the cars being bought that have battery packs in them, all the Tesla vehicles being bought with battery packs in them. Now, last month, Tesla announced its first completely in-house virtual power plants using power walls in California. Ultimately, Tesla wants to become a global decentralized utility electric utility through this business model and they are doing it right now so what's the purpose of the job right well you the purpose of this role is to use autobidder to manage decentralized energy assets and monetize them to the highest bidders electric utilities and make money for tesla and for the consumer or whoever owns the batteries now electric says that there is another company called WattLearn, which is a startup that has appeared to be building an autobidder like software that started even before Tesla. So Lamy, who now works at Tesla, was the founder and CEO of WattLean before it was acquired by an unnamed company in 2018. That company just might have been Tesla. Now, what does this tell us? Well, this tells us what I've been telling you for a long, long time. For those of you messaging me asking if you should still invest in Tesla, the answer is yes. I just did yesterday. This goes to show how much bigger Tesla is than just a car company. That is why their PE is 650. This, energy. This is a key reason. Autonomy, energy, battery storage, battery output, cars, the list goes on. Battery pack manufacturing is the new oil refinery. And it's a great future. I'm looking forward to it. Thanks for watching the video. See you on the next one. Bye-bye.